This video is to help you explore and find the digital interactive games that are available in Abacus. So from the Active Learn Primary homepage, click on the Abacus tile here. And then you can click on resources. And then the Abacus resources area looks like this. Uh, you can then use the menus on the left to filter for interactive games and activities. If you go down to category here and click on interactive game and activity, you can then also filter by your chosen year group and mass strands if you want. Uh, now there are three different types of interactive activities, individual practice games, problem solving games and speaking listening games. So if we click on individual practice games, these are fun interactive games that children can use independently to practice key math skills and facts. They are perfect for homework and are compatible with most tablets. Um, there are 480 games in total across years one to six. Um, and again, you can keep filtering down here by year and abacus strand. Um, you'll see here that there are three versions of each game. And these are the three attainment levels. So this is support when it ends in letter A. This is Hedgehog Hurry Core when it ends in the letter B, and this is the Hedgehog Hurry Extend version when it ends in the letter C. And you can see that's the approach that's taken with all games. And I'll just open them up so you can see an example of that. And you'll see that each game has three levels, bronze, silver and gold. So children start with bronze and work their way up through the levels. And these games are designed to feel like fun sort of arcade type games that children would hopefully choose to play. So that's an example of that. So now if we look at speaking and listening games, we go down here and filter on the left here. Uh, these are interactive activities designed to get pairs of children working together. Um, so these are perfect for pairs of children and they're just a way, an effective way to get children developing mathematical skills and understanding to talk through and discuss. Uh, let's just have a look at one of those. So you can see that's a game for children to play together with somebody else. And each of these games has a how to play button and that will be a video that gives you instructions on how to play the game. And you just press play to watch that help video. And then going on to problem solving games, which are here. Uh, these are interactive activities for children to use individually or in pairs. Um, and it's about them applying their math skills in contextual situations. So here we go. We've got build a railway here. This is an example of the kinds of activities that are in problem solving. And again, like the problems, uh, like uh, speaking and listening, this also has a how to play video. So in this one, you're building a railway track to go over the river. To reach over here. Okay, and as well as interactive activities, you can also access our bank of videos. If we go down to category again and click on video, we can see pupil videos and teacher support videos. 